Alright, hello everyone and welcome back to Monster Menagerie. In this episode, we're going to be making a Kraken exhibit, um, which was pretty highly requested, I think. Um, I definitely saw a few requests for it anyways. So, yeah, and I was very curious to use the uh, download for myself because I haven't yet, so... Yeah, that's what I did. And as you can see here, I'm basically just um, filling the bottom of the tank with a bunch of rocks and of course some sunken ships because I mean that's what the Kraken does doesn't it so yeah and then I put some of these reef uh, those animated reef um, rocks which I'm not sure well if you guys haven't seen before I think you'll you'll, uh, you'll like them they're pretty cool so uh, I try to use them whenever I do um, tanks that would be appropriate I think so and yeah, I just put a few fish around, thought that would probably be good, some starfish scattered around. The actual building of it is pretty simple, I mean, uh, let's be honest, tanks in general are all kind of the same, which is why I don't usually make them that often. Uh, then we put the crack in there, I put those lights in there just so it's not pitch black uh, when you're looking inside. Once you actually go inside the tank though, the lights don't um, do anything, so it's still like super dark in there. And I had this little extra space here. Oh, I did throw those cannons in there too, but I had this little extra space here. I wanted to fill it in with something because it was pretty bare without it. So that's what I did there. And yeah. Um, and I think I also threw a, uh, I think I show it. In the, no, I did cut that part out, but I did throw a uh, um, donation box right there as well as some, uh, well, I didn't even do that. I did that after I did the tour part, that's why. But I put a donation box and some benches and such but yeah so you can see like the lights make a huge difference from out here but they don't really make a big difference what you're inside as you'll see in just a second so I was surprised the only thing I didn't like about the uh, Kraken download is how fast it moves it's like kind of weird I don't know I didn't really like that I think it could have moved slower it would have looked better so but that's just me <coughs> Anyway, we're going to go inside here so you can get a look at what the uh, tank looks like from the inside. But like I said, it's going to be super dark, so you'll have a hard time seeing anything. But I thought that was kind of cool in a way, though. It makes it pretty creepy, uh, which in the end of the day is sort of the point of the zoo anyway. So, um, And you'll see all kinds of things living inside here as well. Because I put those arctic cod swimming around, which look pretty uh, interesting in the dark. And then, see those animated reefs all have fish, and there's a... Uh, more eel right there um, so yeah I like those a lot they really add to those to the tanks and make them go from looking really barren and lifeless to you know really alive and just filled with different aquatic creatures and stuff so and actually inside one of these yeah this sunken ship right here it took me a while to find it because it's so dark in here but there's actually an octopus in there so I think I do um, get it so you can see it in this video but yeah so yeah right here so you can see I put an octopus in there which is pretty cool I think that definitely adds to the uh, <laughs> the creepiness factor I mean could you imagine being in there and then just like knowing that Kraken swimming around and then all those, uh, those octopus and all kinds of other things living in there it'd be pretty freaky I think um, yeah, like at this point you can hardly see anything at all. I was trying to get it to hoping that the Kraken would like, swim right by me so you could get a good look at it. Um, but it was going so fast and it was so impossible to see that just didn't happen, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much going to be the end of this episode, guys. Uh, of course, you can leave your suggestions for what you want to see in the next one. And yeah, I will see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching.